Let's work on finding the names and values of money. Which coin is this? So if we look below at this coin, let's use this scratch pad so I can show you here. Right here it says quarter dollar. So a quarter means one out of four of the dollar and a quarter is worth 25 cents because it takes four quarters to equal one dollar. So let's close out and find quarter. Nice job. What coin is this? Let's use this scratch pad. This one looks a lot like the quarter. It's silver, it's round, it kind of has an eagle shape on the back. However, if you look here, it says half dollar. So this one is not a quarter, but instead it's half a dollar, which means we would need two of these to make a full dollar. So it is half dollar. What coin is this one? Again, let's look at the coin and see if we see anything on it. This says half dollar. So let's close our scratch pad, hit half dollar. Oh, this one is a little bit similar to our last ones. You can see that the edges on this coin look a little bit different than the edges on the other coins. And the eagle here in the middle also looks different. And it says here one dollar. So this is a one dollar coin. Not like a dollar bill, but it's a coin worth one dollar. So let's close that and hit dollar. All right, so let's use this scratch pad to look at this particular coin. And instead of trying to identify the coin, the question in this one is asking how much is this coin worth? So let's first identify what this coin is. It's a little bit smaller, it's silver, and it says one dime. Well, a dime is equal to 10 cents. And you can write 10 cents like this, or you can write it as 10 cents of the dollar. So let's look and see if that's down here. There's 10 cents. Great job. Well, how much is this coin worth? Well, this one looks a lot like that last coin we just saw. It also says the same thing, one dime. And as we said before, a dime is worth 10 cents. We could also write it with the dollar symbol and say 0.1. One zero, or we could write it out as 10 and instead of using the cent symbol like we did up above we could just write 10 cents so this symbol means cents but sometimes we write it out as cents so 10 cents nice work how much is this coin worth well, let's use our scratch pad. We saw this coin a little bit earlier. We noticed it's different edges. We noticed the eagle looked different than some of the other ones. And we also noticed that it said $1 down here. So $1 can be written in a lot of different ways. We can write it as 100 cents, because 100 cents equals a dollar. We could write it like this as with a decimal to show the dollar. Or we could write it as one dollar. So let's look below and see if any of these match. Well this is one cent but this one right here says one dollar and that matches this one if we just got rid of this part over here it would just look like this. So one dollar so let's close that scratch pad. All right how much is this coin worth? Well this coin we haven't seen yet. So this coin is copper. We see here that it says one cent, one cent. So one cent is a penny. So this coin is a penny. So one cent we know looks like this. We know one cent also looks like this. And we also know that we can write it out in words as one cent. Now let's make sure we don't conf get confused with the dollar. So if you notice, the dollar symbol comes before the number and the cent symbol comes after. So this one is one dollar, but this one is one cent. And if you look, it kind of looks like a C to help you see that that's one cent. So let's close that, hit the penny, super job. 
We also have not seen this coin yet. And if you look very carefully, they want us to know how much this coin is worth. You can see right here that it says five cents, which lets us know that this is a nickel. So five cents, we know can be written five cents. We know it can be written with the dollar sign as 0 0.05 or with words as five cents. So let's look here. Let's see if five cents is anywhere. There it is. Awesome, on to our last one. Well, we just had this one, if you remember. This one says, how much is this coin worth? If we remember, it says five cents. We know five cents is a nickel, and a nickel is worth five cents. So let's close that scratch pad, find five cents. Great job. I think we now know how to name the values of money.